Good morning everyone and welcome back to another plan with me. This is Misty with Happy Planning with Misty and this is my March calendar. Yes, I'm behind, but I have been working on orders so the stuff for me has went to the back burner and so I am not complaining because I am very grateful for the orders. <clears throat> Thank you too everyone that has purchased for me and is trying out my shop um before i start laying this down i want to share some happy mail that i got with y'all um, um one of my friends who lives in canada nikki um reached out to me and said i believe i've got some washi you might like and i love washi and so I was so excited and she sent it and of course um, I got it in the mail and it was um, so appreciated and it is, I haven't even looked at them individually yet because I wanted to look at them on here with you guys, but it is all um, simply gilded. And it is so pretty. I ha just have a little bit of Simply Gilded. Um, and I was, I mean, to me, um, if you want an easy pick out of, I don't know, washi to line your, she's just got all kinds of colors, I guess is what I'm getting at. And so, um, I know this might be too fancy for some, or this might not be everybody's cup of tea, um, the Simply Gilded stuff, but um, I love Simply Gilded, especially using it in my Stology. Um, a lot of people like um, more character and cartoon looking, which I also do. I've got several of the sweet bean plans that I use. I just leave it here on my desk because I use it often. Um, so I understand um, liking those too. But <clears throat> these can give a little touch of elegant um, even if you're going with a more um, fun layout these can i don't know they just seem to bring it in so pretty i love it another um youtuber that i watch is harley and she uses simply gilded all the time um in her stology and i will try my best to remember to link her below harley if you watch this if i forget to link you um you comment so um if people want to watch your uh, playing with me, they can go and see how you you simply gilded. But Nikki, thank you so much. Um, I got that in the mail yesterday, and it come. I had no idea when it was coming, but it showed up at just a perfect time because today I go <clears throat> see the neurologist about my migraines, and I've never been to a neurologist and. I've been going over and over in my head what I'm supposed to tell him, like how I hurt, how often I hurt, when it started. And y'all, when I say it all out loud, I sound like I'm going nuts. And so it makes me nervous. But even if I am going nuts, I guess the neurologist is where I need to be. But anyway, the other thing I got was I was ordering um, some paper for um not that i really need a reason why to order anything from amazon but i was ordering some um clear sticker paper because i wanted to um uh, try printing some stuff on clear sticker paper and when i they threw up these suggestions so this is something I want to try. It's a safety cutter made by Slice. Now a lot of people have them that look like they're a, a ink pen or whatever. But I saw this and I want to um, 
try it because it's a ceramic tip blade and I want to try it in, in cutting my paper washi and so I'm going to use it in this plan with me so I wanted to open this first so also I saw this on Amazon let's see maybe it was already open Okay, and this is a pencil pouch, as you can tell, but it's got several pockets in it, and it really seemed to have a lot of room, and this was like in a, um, I don't know if it shows up true to color on here, but it was like in a aqua looking color, and this works well. I got it at the dollar store. But, it's got everything in there. And I wanted to try to separate separate it out. So like my slice tool here and some of the pens that I really like to use here. And see if I couldn't keep this pack here for like um, all my scissors and stuff like that. Um, I don't know, just to try to so these are both Energel, but I've got one that writes black and one that writes purple. I love this purple color, but y'all also know that purple's my favorite color. And so, um, a washi card and stuff like that can go in there. There's another, let's see, I wanna make sure. I've got a spot where all my markers go. I've got a big thing. If y'all hear my stomach growling, I'm not hungry, but it's still growling. It's crazy. But yeah, like this stuff and the scissors and stuff, I want to leave in this pack. I got this at the dollar store too. Ain't that cute? I don't remember that it's down in here because there's so much down in here. But anyway, this is what I'm going to do as far as separating some of this stuff out. Thinning it out so maybe I won't have to dig as much when I'm trying to find stuff. We'll see. They might both get so full up. But anyway, that was my thought process for getting this. And it can also hold some washies, I guess. Um, but yeah, I think it's cute. Turned out very cute and I think it's going to work to sort of um, divide things out. So, now, to get to the fun part. And I need to do a monthly. Sorry, y'all. I had to sneeze. So sorry. Okay, so here's my February. And then I need to do the March. Now, these... This one here, I don't know that I, I know I don't have this one on my Etsy shop. I can't remember if I have this or not because I don't know how many people actually plan in a seven by nine and will actually want to use this in their seven by nine. If this interests anybody else, let me know and I will add these. Either way, I had to have them for my 7x9, so I created it for me. And um, if you want it to be available to where it can be purchased, just let me know. But anyway, this, I'm 
made to wear. Let's start with this other one first, I guess. And then I'll grab that one. This one I make to wear my, um, what do you call it, days of the week can sit on top of and I make them the opposite color um, so that you know they stand out but anyway um, how are you guys doing I hope you're doing good I am so excited about um, all the new people that have signed up to watch my videos y'all that just blows my mind because All right, we're going to try this slice tool out right here on this. So this is a matte vinyl sticker paper. Let me see. Well, that wasn't even the part that I trimmed. And it cut it, y'all. And it did not, I don't think it cut through the paper. I have got to learn, if it did, I've got to learn how much pressure goes with this thing. Let's see. Yes, it did cut through the paper. And I didn't hardly press down at all, so this sucker is sharp. So if y'all get one, be careful. It's hard to wrap my head around something being so sharp when it's, I mean, you can barely see the little blade sticking out of there but I just got a single and they um, sell these in packs of three also now the ones that are sold in packs of three I don't know that they're actually made by slice but it comes with this too to where if you want to put it on a key ring you can put it on a key ring and you know it can travel with you and you can You know use it at different spots well I'm not gonna put it on a key ring I don't need it on my key ring but that don't mean I can't um, decorate put something on the end of there to sort of decorate it but anyway so this is going on here and we'll Cut this again and I'll try not to be bearing down. But yeah, you can feel um, it slide through the paper. But how, I'm not sure how much to bear down yet because I'm still learning. That was a little bit better. And that I don't think went through. But I didn't think it cut nothing either because I didn't feel like I was mashing hard enough. And no, it's just where I put that bottom. All right. So then, I do a Sunday start. So then what you, on this, what you need to do like um, is figure out if you want your column, uh, this box here, if you want it on the right side of your paper or the left side and since I'm right-handed um, I like it on this other sheet over here because if you put you can put this in this first column and then start your Sunday or either start your Sunday here and then put it at the very last column which is what I'm gonna do because um, it's just easier for me to write on this side with me being right-handed but anyway Let's put this here down. But yes, I have been seeing uh, the new people that are subscribing and watching and y'all that take time to comment. That just makes my day. When I sit down in the evening and spot that somebody is saying something to me I get so excited
and it depends on how soon I can get back to y'all also with um, my headache how I'm um, dealing with the headache so just know that I will respond it might be a few hours but I will get back with you guys but either way thank you so much for watching my channel and then those that have took time to just go like on my Etsy shop y'all that means the world I have been getting all kinds of notifications of people that are um, liking things and you know just hitting the like button on things in my shop and that that is putting me in so, now I don't understand algorithms at all when it comes to Instagram and YouTube but it is putting me in an algorithm and I am so thankful very much so and um so we're gonna someone else who has bought for me and uses my stickers if you want to see my stickers at time in use besides just me always talking to you guys you can watch Billy she has bought from me often which I am so grateful for and I will um, try to link her also um, below but Billy if I was to forget to link you um, because I do have a lot on my mind today with having to go to the neurologist and stuff um, comment so people can go watch you on your channel also and um, see how you plan I love watching different planners and getting ideas um, so y'all feel free to share with one another on here if y'all have a YouTube channel and y'all plan um, this channel ain't just about me. It's about us. So y'all share with one another. You're not going to upset me at all. Um, I love having friends. This world would be so dull if we didn't have each other as friends. And what better friend to have than another lady that understands this crazy love we have for stickers at our age well some of y'all are young I'm thinking along my age I was born in 78 so um yeah I feel old but I love playing with stickers and I love my sticker community mm, come on. it's not going to turn loose so y'all just know that this paper that I sell, it feels as smooth as a baby's butt, but it will not come up without tearing your paper. And I have not figured out yet how to get them both. If I get the paper that will come right up, it costs an arm and a leg and it, it's not smooth like this and the colors are not as vibrant so I have not yet found I, ha I don't guess I've been planning long enough or um, hadn't talked to uh, people that can tell me what paper like this paper I love I just wish it would come up um, undo that is going to be your lifesaver. It's on Amazon. Undo. It will not take the ink off the paper. It will not mess up the sticky. It can go back down. It sounds weird. You're like, no, there's no way I'm going to put liquid on my paper. I'm telling you, it's safe. It's good. I've used it on my stickers. What am I wanting next? Oh, I need to... Out of all these planners, I need to find a calendar. Okay, so March the 1st is on a Friday. 
That's what I needed to know. So yes, today is the 20th. So this is definitely behind. But um, I've got everything written down. I just need to um, transfer it. So I've got just a cheap planner from Walmart that is what stays open on my um, dining room table or either uh, coffee table. It, that's what follows me around the house. And then I get on get back here alone sometimes I video sometimes I don't I try to video as many as possible but that's where I get back here either way and start um, putting it in the planners I want to put it in um, for me to look at with my stickers and for it to be pretty and um, enjoyable but for me to just scratch it out to where I can let's see Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday the 13th um, scratch it out to where I can just you know make sure it at least gets put down um, it goes in the one that's cheap and not decorated and then I just like I said transfer it into the different planners that um, I like to sit and look through and flip through and plan in um, uh, what do you call what would I call it uh, plan it At my own pace you know because the other planner you write it in right then right when you talk to the doctor's office or right when you talk to whoever the groomers or whatever but then I like to have these planners to where I can transfer it um, let me make sure I'm doing this right y'all because I'm trying to talk and do it so yes, um, to where I can transfer it um, into a planner that I enjoy planning in, one that's not just scribbled, because that other planner also has my shop notes and my daily house notes in it, and so they need to be divvied up. But anyway, that is just my way of planning so what have y'all got planned for are y'all already on spring break our spring break does not start till this following monday here where i live so the 25th is when ours so it's the very last week in march um but i know that some places are already doing their um spring break and so if y'all have already had your spring break, did y'all just hang around close to home and save as much money as you could? Or did you go somewhere? We are planning on going somewhere. We're um, going to go Friday, leave Friday morning to go camping. And it's about four or five hours from us. And we, I pull the boat, Marshall pulls the camper, but it's the cheapest way for us to do something for um, spring break um, with me homeschooling it helps 
get me and Maddie away from the house and out of the house without going to a hotel and having to rent a hotel because since we, you know, have the camper, we just, of course, sleep in the camper. So we don't have to do um, a hotel room. And then there's, thankfully, Maddie loves fishing. And so it's easy just to let her and her dad, and sometimes I'll go, sometimes I don't. It depends, again, on what my headache is doing. Sometimes I just stay at the campsite, build a fire, and, y'all, that is so relaxing just to watch and listen to the lake water and have a campfire and, yeah. I don't have to have... I'm going to half up this day. I know a lot of people might not like doing it this way. But I don't mind it halfing up this day. Especially since it's a Sunday and Sundays are uh, not no kind of business stuff going on on Sundays. So we're going to put the 31st, I don't know where to stick it, <laughs> that won't look right, that won't look right, I guess I'll just do it like that, okay, so then, so that's how it's looking as far as that way so then I've got this page so on this page um, my silhouette was acting so crazy yesterday when I was printing this so I started out with this pattern and this is three more boxes so I had this color in some of these boxes and this sheet I printed out first, and then I went to this sheet and was doing finishing touches on it. And all of a sudden, everywhere I had used this pattern, everything was coming up black. It was not coming up with the pattern. So I went out of silhouette, brought silhouette back up, same thing. It wouldn't print it in color, wouldn't show it in color, it was solid black. It's like, what in the world? So I said, okay, well, let me just try some random color. I picked like a purple and a pink, just something way out there. It was still just showing it up black. I don't know what happened, but something with the color or either these boxes, I don't know. It went nuts, but I had to use this pattern. This is the only one I could get to go in there that matched that didn't come out black. So, I went with it, y'all. But anyway, I've got your words that go with the picture. So, laundry and vacuum, which I have a Roomba. So, that's the reason we got that kind of vacuum. But, set it up on whatever days you need to. Um, if you don't want to use a box because there's too much going on in your box, I've got these hearts to where you could write more than one thing. Um, then I've got just a few um, holidays, wacky holidays in March set up. So, supposedly according to the internet, March the 3rd was Princess's Day. So, I'm going to stick her there. It says March the 7th was Flapjack Day. So, I got us some pancakes. Who don't like pancakes? Then it said the 16th was Panda Day. Y'all, I don't know where they come up with these. I couldn't come up with them on my own. I definitely had to Google them. World Frog Day is today, and I love frogs, and I was like, 
Hallelujah. This just turned out. I like kawaii frogs. Let's get that straight. Frogs in the yard. Don't want to mess with them or touch them. No. Kawaii frogs. They are so cute. And I needed that cuteness on today. And then Little Red Rag and Wagon Day is the 27th. I didn't realize those were right underneath each other. All right. So then the all these boxes up here that were not used, you're welcome to use these boxes to fill them in. You can fill them in with washi if you don't mind them being... Um, blank then don't worry at all about filling them in um, I think I'll fill some in just to give some color mm -hmm, I think that's gonna be a little long let's see so we might have to do a little sticker surgery here do that um, use that for the sticker surgery let's see here oh sorry hang on y'all I'm knocking y'all around see this is what I mean another washi card I'm still knocking y'all. I'm sorry. Okay. Let's run this right through the middle. Look at there. That came up so easy. I had to get it off this washi card. There we go. So let's try another one. And of course, you have to be real quiet when you're laying this stuff down. And that little thing, it fit right down in there. Perfect. All right, and then we'll do one here. Look at that. That just that's amazing, y'all. Oh, it don't take much to flabbergast me. Okay, so now going back with um my icons so here's these boxes too that can be used um, on the first and a Friday so this is my trash bill is due so we're gonna put this on here And then grab my trash can. So not only do I need to put the trash out, I need to also 
pay them. Okay, so we're going to pay for the trash. And then I don't have, I guess I need to add like a birthday sticker type thing on here. I don't have but the 11th was my dad's birthday. So I'm going to put that on here. And I know that some of you guys had birthdays in March. So, happy birthday, y'all. Um, get my reusable sticker book here. And see if I've got... I've got balloons. See if I've got... Um, There's a cake. I'm gonna see if I had a cake. This is a sweet Kauai design cake. All right, so put this here. Let me get, here's a little party hat. We're just gonna go all out for decorating this. This is gonna be for dad and for you guys. So happy belated birthday. I hope y'all have a wonderful year i'm very grateful and thankful i still have my dad all right dad's birthday all right let me see here what else monday art class so i've got that and that is also do bill for art class so I'm going to put that here and Maddie's doing so good y'all she's through with another painting that she done I need to go run in there and get that painting because that one ha we hadn't put it up for sale yet so y'all can see mm. let's see I need a art sticker. I got one around here somewhere. Let me look in these icons that are in my shop. Let's see if I can find art sticker. I can't remember what icon number it is. So I'm just going to flip through here till I spot it. Ah, oh, there it is. Alright, here's the art sticker. I need to pay art. So hang on, I'll go get that painting of hers. So her favorite thing to do is to take pictures or to find pictures that have sunsets. She loves sunsets. So she had, um, I don't know if she took this picture or her dad sent it to her. But here we here it is again of the lake. We just love being on the lake. But anyway, um, and back in here you can tell in this picture um, if you get real close, like the camping and the and the um, you can see the little dots of stuff back in there that are camping and shore. That's what I'm trying. But anyway, this was the picture, and she laid this. No, clipped this up above her. And this is what she painted. And I get a text while she's at art class. Mom, 
I can't stand this painting. I didn't do it justice. It looks horrible. She said that about herself before. And I'm like, Maddie, please bring it home. Because she'll just go chunk them. Um, she'll paint like this. And then if she don't like it, it don't suit her fancy. She just goes and chunks it. Now, mind you, at the art studio where she was painting, there were people walking up behind her saying, Oh, Maddie, I love how you're painting and um, painting with your oil paint. She said, I'm not painting with oil paint. She said, I'm painting with acrylics. You got acrylics to look like that? Uh, yeah. So, and of course, I'm biased because I'm mother, but she had more than one person, several people, in fact, tell her, Maddie, that, that's a good job. And so, bless her heart, she just, she don't think it was, she didn't think it was good enough. So, um, I thought she'd done a good job, but I am also mom, so, anyway. Uh, so today is the 20th, and I've got a doctor's appointment today. So, let's see. Since I've got my little froggy there, these boxes are going to be, um, I don't know that I can move him up. We're going to need to try or I'll show y'all how this works. If y'all hadn't ever used it, it don't take much. Look at there. Already lifting. It's just a smidgen. And it does not make the colors run. And it does not take it sticky away. And since it's like an alcohol base, it dries quick. All right, so now I'll have room to put my doctor's appointment on here. Let's see. And I've got this little stethoscope. And it's kiss cut. So you have to be gentle. Pulling him off. Put that on there. And of course put my frog back on there. Look at there, works just right. Okay, and then Friday, we're gonna leave to go camping. I think I'm gonna use me a heart on this one. Let's see, let's just go with the top one. And I've got a little car, we'll use it. And I'm just gonna write right on the page, gone camping. And I'm going to put down here, let's see, I can start it here, spring break. Spring break starts. Let's see if we've got some kind of, I don't have no fun celebrating. We can find one though. Let's see. Let's 
What have we got? I was gonna make sure I didn't have um, a camper, a tent or something. But I don't. Um, let's see if I can. Just flip through these real quick and see what I can find that. I've got like lazy days and. Not today's and this looks like because she um Tasha's got Frank with a camera and with a backpack not a backpack but a fanny pack so we're gonna just use old Frank looks good to me all right, guys, so um, also, if y'all would rather use more deco, I've got these kit cut, Kiss Cut Gnomes to go with this spread um, that you can definitely use to decorate. I've got, got one down here for your notes section. Um, but yeah, there's plenty of wonder if we can put one up here since I don't have a notes word there. Let's see if we can just set him up here. There we go. And then we can start our notes section. I think that's cute, y'all. So if you like this monthly plan with me, give me a thumbs up. And subscribe I'm sorry it was so long y'all but thanks for watching and tuning in y'all you mean a lot to me and I'll talk to y'all later bye